you've seen benches like these on Lee County streets lately. They were designed to give our kids a safe place to stay away from the road while they wait for the school bus. NBC2's Joseph Ojo is live in Cape Coral tonight. Concerned, we're talking to people who are concerned that a hurricane could send them airborne. Well, after two tragic deaths, there have been fights to prevent this. Kids sitting at dark bus stops on the ground. So they um, installed these benches, but this bench right here is not actually mounted. It's only tied down to this stop sign. Neighbors say if Hurricane Dorian hits, an item like this can fly. Hurricane Dorian is on the move to Florida. I was doing schoolwork and I just found out that we were under a state of emergency. Our tank is full. We just replaced the battery. Leaving neighbors like Chris Spires to clear up items around his home, which can cause damage. But this whole hurricane is really hitting us by surprise with uh, everything that we have to do to prepare ourselves. One of the items causing concern has become benches like these. The stronger winds could definitely make something move like that. The benches were installed around Lee County after the deaths of Layla Aiken and Alana Tamplin, but the benches were never mounted for protection and are chained up to light poles and stop signs for security. It's mother nature. It happens. Um, but kids getting hit and killed by cars, that's not mother nature. Now the group benches for our babes who installed the benches wants your help. If you have space in your garage and you can pull a couple in, pull a couple in. They say if you live by one of the picnic tables that are chained up, look for the key nearby and unlock the chain and flip the bench over. You go out and you just flip them over. The wind's not going to get underneath them. They're not going to move. And the city of Cape Coral did not install this bench, so they are not responsible for it. But they say they will um, like, uh, kind of uh, measure out Dorian to see how that actually goes. And if, if needs be, they will have crews out here to remove these picnic tables. In Cape Coral, Joseph Ojo, NBC2. All new.